255 here. What up? You know what? If I get into my inner wife who love, if I, if I develop a strong wife who love, I can see myself playing with a character like Jacko. Is that she seems to be a pretty heavy projectile character. And uh, the problem with that is that in Guilty Gear, if you have somebody like Nagoruki, who gets you, if you have somebody like Nagoruki, who hits you like two or three times, he, after you spent 30, 40 seconds, how many seconds you're spending projectile, he can make up for all of that. This, this is not a great game for being a projectile character. Certainly there are other Arc Systems games and other versus games where that's a great idea, but I don't think that that's great here. Our other puppet character, Zato, you know, he was doing good, he was doing his thing, but I mean, <laughs> he's not exactly at the top of uh, most people's tire list. Let's just call it like that. But I just don't think that projectile characters in this current game of, of Guilty Gear do very effectively. Unless they have like heavy priority. I don't know what priority that Jackal's projectiles are going to have versus maybe a Ram. Look at Kai. He's a he's supposed to be a projectile character. He he definitely is, but uh I mean it's, he, he, he can't exactly zone you from far away, and it's got pretty good recovery. So I don't know. Maybe she's supposed to be kind of like a pet character. As far as playing as waifu chicks, I would prefer maybe, you know, it would be a great guest character if they had near or 2B, I think it is. Not 9S. Yeah, 2B or 2A as guest characters in this game. That would be pretty good. Or give us biking. I'll take her as well, but. I mean, most people hated this character in x -Hard. And if you look at most of the content creators' reaction to it, they don't, they particularly don't care for this, for this character. So far, when it comes to Guilty Gear DLC characters, I can live without Gold Lewis, the opposite, the absolute uh, tire low tire of absolute defense i think that's what the rueful manga called him so i i don't need it i can live without it i really can live without it i i hope she does whatever they're hoping that she does but right now i don't i don't see her being a high tire I could be wrong we haven't seen her full gameplay you don't see what type of damage her projectiles do but uh i just i don't see Anybody being an effective zoner in this game. I like to give them some seriously good um, chip damage or uh, decent damage on the projectiles. I've been enjoying Guilty Gear. Overall, do I agree with uh, Sonic Fox's statement that I don't care about this? I do care about this game. I do think they could have a lot more interesting characters in this season one pass is not looking that excellent and i don't know if they think that they can get away with what they got away with dragon ball dragon ball has a lot of great memorable characters and it has a great uh lineup so they can get away with this stuff but guilty gear strive i don't know so i'm hoping to see more interesting characters more characters that are, uh, appeal to a broader audience and uh Having big boy go Lewis and then a uh, waifu Jacko or her waifu Jacko. I don't know if that's appealing to the most broad audience, you know? I know a lot of people looking forward to me with characters like Happy Chaos or Johnny. I personally would like Slayer, but I don't know. I'm hoping that they got some great characters for the lineups. Robot Key, Soul Order Kai. But Jacko, man, she's okay, but I could live without it. Yo, this is DeepMod255 out. One, peace.